lemon drops from... That means you were at Cracker Barrel. You ho! So does that mean you're for hire? What's a lemon? You could use the work. There's a cache of anthracillin tucked away in the old community center. Powerful stuff. Stronger than what we got, anyway. I need you to break it. Nab that medicine and bring it back to me. I'll do what I can. I tried medicating myself. I love them, Toasty. Time. It's Didn't like an addiction. Me, as far as I can tell. I can eat these in like I can't just buy a couple days if I don't restrain myself. Is strictly prohibited to any workers beneath the acceptable margin of health. Company policy. More like the company won't treat me because I'm not healthy enough. <laughs> she she's loved uh, Cracker Barrel longer than maggot people have been, uh, have been alive, Cole. Or been a, a thing. You will not find any guards within sight of that old place. Marauders, on the other hand. Yeah. I have it on good authority. There's a gang of them squatting there. I advise stepping softly. Okay. So you'll do it then? Sure. Can you oblige me with your haste? I think I feel the plague spreading. Oh, Lord, it's in my spleen now. I can feel it. Just keep your head down when you're in there. Marauders have taken over. Probably tracking mud all over the archives. I know that, but I got nobody else to turn to. Wasabi peas? Mm. Reed would have wrote me up. Constable would have locked me up and wrote me up. Could have gone to see the good vicar, but I never did. Look at his hair. Bridge. It looks like his hair is dyed gray, like because his like roots, t his tips look black. Gonna help this idiot. You're making a mistake working for Abernathy. Excuse me, I'm Esther Blaine, Spacer's Choice Actuary. I overheard your talk with Abernathy. I hope you're not thinking about getting him that medicine. Okay, do tell me. Abernathy is a well-known hypochondriac. Anthracillin is wasted on him. You're better off selling it to me instead. All I'm saying is Abernathy's worked in this town longer than some of us been alive. How do I put this gently? He's a... Excuse me, I was listening when I sh was, should have been. I probably shouldn't tell you. Don't want you implicated for what I'm trying to do. Well, you're telling me. All right. Here's a summary. A lot of sick people in this town, and we don't have the medicine to treat them all. Can't reach out to corporate without crossing a river of red tape, so I'm reaching out to you. I'm paid better than Abernathy. Whatever he's giving you, I will do you one better. I'll think about it. That's all I can. This miss like, yeah, um, I'm going to need you to like, you know. Okay, I'm still not getting the buttons. Uh. Okay, he still had. We have to figure out what he wants. And there's someone over here. Excuse me, don't mind me. I was just uh being uh a rude ass son of a bitch. Not listening, not doing what I should be doing. Oh fuck. I think it was up here. Bitch, how do you keep teleporting behind me? You mind if I like murder everyone here and Is this one of those games you can murder everyone everywhere and then like you have to figure out how to do things anyways? Okay, where is this? What? 
What in the air fryer? The chicken parmesan? I look on the thing on the on the uh, refrigerator. I have. I don't remember the instructions. You're a sassy suka. My wife is sassing me, everyone. She's sassing the shit out of me. Love you later. Have fun, Toasty. Hmm. Do, do, do. Okay. Where is this other person? Over here. Okay. This game is only tracking one quest at a time, it seems like, which is preferential. They're like giant dandelions. Give me my money. Lovely to see you above, Miss Parvati. Things going all right, Silas? Been keeping him careful and true, miss. Something I can do for you? You run into any trouble? Conrad's barbershop is a yawning pit that swallows his every bit. I keep telling him he should cut a few corners. Skimp out on the disinfectant. You gotta put the squeeze on Conrad. Find some dirt on him. Maybe check his back room. Well, that's the word, extortion. Been on the tip of my tongue all day. <laughs> okay, douche. This guy's a douche. Okay, I guess we're going this way. Since I can see it on the map, that means, like, it's anywhere where I can, you know, do it, right? Or run in, find him. Cole, what you been up to, my friend? Level three. Okay. I just like being So we get a perk every other level, right? When I was nice little we freighters in every Sunday noon. Now they only come but once a month. Hey Mr. Money. Does anyone have smooth skin Thanks in this place? I've been requisitioning backup for months. Guess the boss finally came to his senses. Um, you ever swung a truncheon? That's nice not what I'm here for, sir. I want to make sure you're up to snuff. I'm just going to get to the point. I told Silas I'd pay my dues if he agreed to join the resistance. Guess this means he's finally heard the calling. The war, the coming apocalypse, man versus machine. I'm talking about mechanical soldier. It's very Cold, appreciated, Bob. Cold, automatons made of iron and lies. That's right. That's what I've been saying. We gotta square our shoulders and stand ever. Everyone in this freaking place is crazy. To mechanicals. Creatures forged in the fires of malevolence. I seen them over by the old power plant. Clattering about. Get swifty with firing the hey Orchestrating What's up, friend? Uprising. Welcome. The What's up, buddy? How you doing? How was your stream? Here, we got a... Let's get a shout out. I don't know how many... Uh, God damn it. My cap socks is on. How was your stream, friend? More Dead by Daylight. Hold on, come on. Can I crawl it? 
She's gonna pick me up, and I think I might have time to wiggle out. I had quite no, a you don't have it. time to wiggle out again. Man! What a fucking yeet, though. Oh Are you playing God. as Leon? It looks like Leon. You gonna do it? Oh, wow. Oh, come on, come on. A few more inches. Ah, oh. uh, so, so you didn't make it, it looks like? Welcome all. I am Rod. I'm a variety streamer. I play a lot of things. I am currently... I didn't know what to play today, so we were playing Outer Wilds. Outer World. Outer World? God damn it, too many games. But welcome. Welcome all to this shit show Where that is my stream. Where will you be? <laughs> Cowering beneath your cot? Or standing? Shoulder to shoulder with the resistance. That's pretty funny. Uh, okay. I've been gathering up a war chest over yeah, the years. Yeah, it's Tuna diabolical chunks. I stuff. have a channel Keep rewards. If you look at my channel I'll points, you where you can today. put me in pigtails. <laughs> Enlistment fees. Yeah, I suppose. Wouldn't want to give the resistance a bad name. Nice. Nice. They have sent I'm glad you had a good uh, stream though, friend. The junkyard just behind our beloved town. The scout must not be permitted to return to its base of operations. Cross it off, then report back. And Cole, I'm good, man. It's uh I finished up last week I played through Control. And and I played a little bit of Turtles on Saturday, and I was like, I have no idea when I wanted to play. So it was like kind of d debated, and then like we ended up here, and yep. Mechanicals got a weak spot in their midsections. I think the technical term is works um, busy. The Everything's busy. Glowy square things. <laughs> His hand behind me was messing with me. Go on. I'm Ludwig Miller. Oh, dude, Cole, it's so good. Transportation. I had a blast Officially? with that on Saturday. Unofficially, strictly between you and me, I am the only thing standing between Edgewater and yep. Total and I. I got you're completely correct. My wife brought me home some lemon drop candy, so I'm excited about that also. Okay, we need to figure out the last couple guys in here. Hey, you know what, Pug? You know what? Just because it's accurate doesn't mean you need to say that out loud. Just because it's accurate, Pug, doesn't mean you need to say it out loud. Well, I really don't want to mess with this guy, and... What can I do for you? Oh? Am I in the company of a fellow doctor? I am a Spacer's Choice certified surgeon, and if you must know, I can stitch a severed thumb. I thought he was with a, a barber. Eight percent chance of avoiding gangrene. I don't own that many pug. Go ahead, you asshole. I have like a couple hundred games in Steam, but I've also I'm also 38 and have been buying shit for years, you know. Edgewater has been good to me. I consider myself privileged to work here. I am never wanting for work, not since the play I mean, started. Pug. I have games in different stores because things like I bought this when it was only on the Epic Store and stuff like that. The plagues come at us with a vengeance this year. Lost six workers in as many months. I wouldn't call them good workers, mind you. If they were any good, they'd have been treated. Yeah, Cole, a lot Still, of everything in the Epic. Shame. I bought like two games in the Epic Store and I have like bunches because I, I just go in and give Zeke free money. Fever, chills, fatigue, aching, vomiting, an excess of phlegm, a tendency towards belly aching. Company policy, friend. We don't have enough medicine to treat all of us, so we treat the best among us. I do not own Steam. Zeke has like 2,000 games in his library. 
Nature is monstrous, friend. And this plague is natural selection at I'm work. old, Agile, and I've been doing this a long time. No, I haven't been doing it a long time, but I've, I've been buying games for a long time. Okay, we need to figure out how to fucking, like... Do I have to go into his, like, back room or some shit? Seems like they want me to break in and figure out... I also I also have been like working at a full time job for almost fifteen years. Uh because I'm an old man. Hey, you hear about Wilson? Okay, this is up there, but where the fuck is it? Where's Phyllis at? Phyllis. Where are you, Phil? Oh, she's up here. I don't like. I don't play much on the Epic Game Store. You the new worker? Whatever. Make it quick, Tenderfoot. I'm busy. Shit. Silas still on about that. Here, take the fees. I'd appreciate it if you didn't tell Reed I was late on my payment. Because they're not my fees and not my gravesite. Guy I worked with shot himself. I paid the bill. If you're not familiar with board law, you ought to be. Law requires delinquent gravesite fees to be paid by the deceased party's closest living relative, which meant me. Shame, though. Eugene was a good worker. And he shot himself? Woke up one morning and put a round through his upper story. Can't imagine why. The kid was doing all right at his desk. We all I complete games, yes. I have... Between the two of us, I'm pretty shocked his weapon... Well, that, I mean, I didn't beat Turtles on stream, but that was like, because I it was the, the second... I beat, I beat most games I play on stream. Sometimes Cole's just trolling me. Cole hasn't even been here in a, in a while, and now he's back here trolling me. I mean, I do stop games when I when they're not like for me, Pug. Never, you're a liar, troll. Cole, your name even rhymes with troll. Cole, troll. Okay, I gotta go. What am I getting stuck on? What am I supposed to like? Like you know. Yep, it, you got me. You got me. You got me. I am the troll here. Everything I do is trolly. Nothing else works. What can I do for you? You know about Eugene? How? Then, you know Phyllis suggested selling off Eugene's gold teeth. I didn't approve of the idea then, and I don't approve of it now. Eugene's golden teeth were a family heirloom, representing three generations of poor dental hygiene. He took them to his grave. You have to do something, bitch. That's unthinkable. Eugene's body and all rare earth minerals contained therein are solely the property of Spacer's choice. I can't ask Silas to dig up a man's body and pry a few teeth loose from his jaw just to pay my bills. Can I? Uh, are you asking rhetorically? Because if you're being serious... Ugh, gross. Desperate measures, Miss Holcomb. Desperate measures. I'm going to Not have to cool, ask Silas but a troll. to dig up those teeth. Yep, I think that would work too, cool. the only way I'm paying my gravesite fees. Here you are. Gravesite papers affixed with my signature and an IOU. Eugene was not a suicide. He put a bullet in his brain, yes, but that's largely a technicality. I was the one who prepared Eugene's body for interment. I discovered symptoms of the plague on his corpse, and I discovered medicine in his pocket. Lots of medicine. 
Eugene overdosed on Adrena time, which is known to cause psychosis and paranoia as possible side effects. The paranoia drove him to take his own life. We can all thank our lucky stars that young Eugene was hopped up on medication and suffered its predictable side Corey, effects. Corey, what's up, buddy? I included it all in my official report. I'd like to think I saved Edgewater a great deal of money. We never could have paid the fines associated with a suicide. Man, you, this, I forgot how much I hate everyone in this town. Corey, how you doing, buddy? What kind of fucking pig was that in that poster, man? Fucking nightmare fuel. Fucking nightmare fuel. Fancy threads. That's some kind of high. Yeah? What about him? Yeah. Funny thing. Eugene's body ain't where it's supposed to be. The night we were supposed nice, to buddy. send his body to the earth, I had his grave all dug up and ready, right? And so I thought, I'll just rest my eyes a bit. When I woke up, his body was gone. Spirited away. Vanished. The footprints nearby suggested that Eugene was stolen. Vanished. Dun, dun, dun. Dun. Let me know if you find anything. Motherfucker stole his body, huh? How do we find out where his body went? Grave digging's a fine profession. Yeah. Nothing I could do though. Do you have a good day though, Corey? Okay, let's look at our inventory, our journal. Isn't he Silas? That's why is it not letting me turn the quest in? Something. You run into any trouble? Reliable work from our Okay, that's what it was. That's gonna take some getting used to. And I'll buy you a drink sometime. Uh, suppose you've earned it. One good turn deserves another. Give me more money. Okay. So now we want to do. I guess we gotta do this first. Going this way. I have to go back into the office tomorrow. My office days are Wednesday, Thursday. Um, but I've been going in random days when I need to too, which sucks, but it is what it is. Ate some gummies for lunch, like weed gummies. Seems like it would make your lunch way, like, way more fun. <laughs> what kind of code are you writing? Yeah, that's what my in is too. It's uh, coal. Don't you do construction coal? So what's up, friend? You see uh, uh, LZT's vacation pictures? Man, he's, like, living the life right now. There's a nice, like, beach and fucking gorgeous beach in Greece. Yeah, I, I'm... I The last time I tried to play it was when... Uh, before I upgraded my uh, video card and RAM. But it, it's running better now after I turned the fucking frame rate down to 120. They had unlimited freights on frames and like for some reason and I don't understand why but Yeah. Go ahead and ignore the lady with the gun. Yeah, he uh I I like LZT on a vacation that, that's pretty dope. Let's go talk to this lady. Oh gosh. If you're hungry, there's meat turning on the spit outside. 
If you're bearing illness, find a place to lay your head down and I'll fetch you a poultice. Her hairdo is kind of scary. Edgewater, leave them at the gates and be welcomed here. Any questions, dear? I have been called that, among other things. Green thumb, grandmother, the strange old lady who keeps flowers. But yes. But her skin looks younger than most of the people in this colony. Excuse me. Mr. I don't know Bennett. either, Beso. I'm kind of I'm just, playing a, a persuasion character. Why, thank you. You're Robert's girl, aren't you? I remember when you were but a sprout. Thomas speaks of you often. Are you staying long? You should try some of my tobacco tea. I brew it in an old spittoon, but it's been cleaned. You here on behalf of that cold-eyed reptile? Let's hear it. What's Reed's idea of peace, then? Um... I am. I'm a smooth talker. Make amends. Spare me. Only thing Reed knows how to make is a mess. Like everything else that comes out of Edgewater, that peace offering is king. I and my own are living just fine out here by ourselves. He would do such a thing. The question is, why would you agree to his plans? Your skin is smooth, lady. Cannery's got a regulator. You want ship parts, you ought to rip them out of the cannery's guts and leave us be. If you're going down to the plant, you should divert power away from Edgewater and toward our end of the grid. Think about it. You'd be liberating an entire town from a lifetime of service. I think I'm going to do that, man. Cannery. Fuck this, like, stupid Seems corporation. The sort of thing a hero would do. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. I trust you will listen to your conscience. <laughs> That's a good look, Corey. I like it. Well. I don't think I could go this way, then. That means I have to go around. This is always, like, my favorite part of, like, follow-up. Oh, man. I could talk to the chicken? Talk, chicken, talk! Talk, chicken, talk! Mr. Chicken, talk to me. Okay. I want chicken tenders for dinner. So, chicken. Mmm. <laughs> Yeah, best so, uh, like it's made by the people who made fucking uh, New Vegas, and New Vegas is such a good game. I'm like, by far my favorite Fallout experience. But I never really played one and two. I like kind of played them, but Bok Bok, motherfucker. Probably because it didn't have the name Fallout on it. I assume. Can I like hack this or some shit? Apparently not. Can I like hack this thing? That's a good, uh, that's a good channel point reward. I don't know if it's enough, 
That seems like not enough points, though, is Corey. But maybe it is. Huh. Now I'm getting ideas, Corey. Now I'm getting ideas. Oh, I don't have any hack things. I wish I was partner. I can't figure out what I want as an emotes. <laughs> nice, Bezo. I like it. Okay. I have a lot of ammo, so... Where did you come from? Oh, my companion lady died. Betty is a diehard. Um, that was not what was supposed to happen in this situation. I don't know why my lights feel like they're brighter today. Rod John Smug. Can I like hack this or something? Does she come back if, like, I if she gets hurt? I don't know how it works. Okay, inventory. Do I have, like, a, a stronger weapon somewhere? This does 110. 110. Okay. Does it have... Okay. I like her. She's cool. She's cool. Still getting used to the controls. Where did she go? See, this is the problem with not putting enough points into weapons and shit. It's like, you scared me, lady. A dead scientist. She seems pretty badass, man. They're like bodies and like robot corpses and should be off to the right. I hope we're doing the right thing. <laughs> 
Man. I'm starting to remember me going a similar route when I tried to play this before and just not having <laughs> enough weapon like po or firepower to deal with things well enough. Did I just run out of ammo? Fuck! I have no ammo. Well. I guess we're hitting people with a sword. Because I don't have any pistol bullets. Okay, so that means we have to figure out how to fix the power. I mean, that's the problem, Pug. You can't talk your way out of every situation, unfortunately. I wish I could talk my way out of every situation. Okay, we have ammo again at least. But what is the right weapon, Cole? What is the right weapon? Really, how do they consider this stealing when I'm fucking in this plant by myself that no one's here? Fucking bullshit. And the man is his bullshit laws and rules and regulation. This this whole this whole Incoming. Well now we're gonna have problems. I sorted the shit out of that guy. We need, like, need an energy weapon because it seems like all the robots are dropping energy weapons or energy ammo and stuff. Man, why are you dead under here, dude? Well, I mean, I would prefer to go completely pacifist, but I don't know how to do that in this game. To be completely honest. Two more. What will happen to go. Oh, you fucking asshole. During your adventures, things may happen to your character that can trigger a flaw offer. Taking the flaw is optional, but doing so provides you with a perk. The choice is yours. Okay. Auto mechanicals now give you the willies, and when you're nearby, you're not as effective as you should be. Uh, I don't. I don't know. Should we start taking? Uh, I I I don't think I want to do that. Like it's way too much, and like seems like there's going to be way too many robots to be like going, yeah, we want to be fucked up uh, around robots. Well, 
Like, if we're fighting a bunch of robots, what the fuck is this thing? We need to level up our hacking. We need to level up our hacking. You're not real. Is there, I hear someone. Where the fuck is he? Sounds like someone's crazy. Where's the crazy person? Let's go find him. Where is the crazy person? Do, do, do. Where is the crazy person? Do, 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 do. Where is the crazy person? Yeah, exactly. That's why I didn't take a puck. I'm like, nah, man. Where is the crazy person? Do, do, do. Where is the crazy person? Do, 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 do. Down. Sounds like someone is, like, not in good state. Hi, person. You're not real. You're not real. Get away from me, Phantom. Shoot. Scram. To your hairline. You can talk? The Phantom's never talked before. Oh, I knew I shouldn't have eaten that sprat raw. All See, these guys, everyone in this game's like faces look like their skin is like. Ingesting. Clearly, I missed like pulled one of the tight over the their faces, which terrorized me on occasion. Terrorize me D on Higgins. occasion. The D stands for definitely not insane. I use it as a reminder. Oh, Higgins has been many things over the years. Sprat Wrangler, Saltuna Critic, Aether Wave Personality, Chairman of the Board, Galactic Defender, Sisty Pig Tycoon. I've come a long way for someone who started off as a simple engineer right here in this plant. I specialized in auto mechanicals, Drones, sentries, repaired them, maintained, upgraded, did it all from my old workroom just over in the next section. Look, I don't want to fall into any trouble with the mechanicals. If they wise up to our plans, they will come for us with prodding irons. <laughs> You know, you remind me of myself back when I was an intergalactic adventurer. I discovered a flaw. Their hostility levels were hardwired to maximum. There's no changing that, but you could rewrite their targeting protocol so they attack each other instead. Yes, that's exactly it. I see you're also versed in the noble art of mechanical engineering. There's a behavior control terminal in the other room. It should have options to change how the mechanicals act, including whom they shoot at. Oh, that reminds me. You'll need my passcode to access the behavior control terminal. Here, let me just write it down for you. The tail. Definitely start with the tail. If you're feeling adventurous, the ears are a particular delicacy. Jimmy'd opened the vending machines. That lasted a good couple of months. Eventually, I had to resort to more unconventional means of filling my insides. Braised, boiled, charred, skewered. Sprats are good eating, friend. Chock full of brain food. <laughs> yeah, I can tell you're not the crazy sounding or anything. Bolts. Open fire on anything. He would pug. Giggity. Pandemonium. I was on cleaning duty at the time. My old boss had me scrubbing pipes when the killing started. So, as usual, I missed out. Okay. Where is this room? He made it seem like it was on this floor, but... So this, none of this is red, so like it's not stealing, so... Okay. See if we get. I mean, eating my tail 
sounds like you're gonna eat my ass, and I enjoy having my ass eaten, so we're good. I don't know, Pug. Are you my type? I don't know about that. Don't have any way to hack. Mind the steam. You're liable to get scalded. Journal. So where does he want, where the... Okay, it's up that way, okay. So just avoid the it's fuck. Security Jesus Christ. That almost killed me. Where did... You gotta get these fucking robots. Not have enough of ammo for this. Did we already go? Oh, fucking shit. What's eating you? Okay, it's saved after talking to this guy at least. But holy fuck, man. I don't know how. Maybe we need to be sneaking around? I don't fucking know, man. Head to head with these motherfuckers is not working out well for the home team. Let's go this way where we came from. Yeah, we went the wrong way last time. Okay, there that that is dealt with. We do not have to worry about that anymore. Jesus. The robots fucked us up, man. A oh, holy fuck. Okay, I'm going this way, I guess. We have to go up, down one floor, and then this door over here is, yeah. The robots won't come after us anymore. Why are you fighting this thing? We may. I thought they were only supposed to be fighting other robots. Or maybe because she started firing at him like an idiot. If we send the power to Miss McDevitt, what happens to her? I don't know. Oh, Oh. 
literally no ammo. I would never suggest anything that involves condoms, Odious. I would never suggest I'm not I'm all about not condoms. <laughs> Fuck condoms. Fucking condoms suck. I mean I mean These games always get me with all the fucking loot. There's always so much loot. I mean... But how do we even know about Alien VD? You know what? We're saying fuck the man. We're fucking the corporation in the ass. Once we do this, there's no going back. The alien SD. Excuse me, ma'am. Look, I know you want your power regulator and all, but I just gotta ask you. Do you understand what you're about to do? Okay, we're gonna hear your opinion. I don't think you should cut off Edgewater's power. I think it would be cruel. I I'm sorry. That just sort of came out all at once. Edgewater's hurting. We've been losing workers year after year, and corporate hardly ever sends replacements. There's barely enough Saltuna to fill our bellies anymore. But the town's got some good people in it. Decent, hard-working but. folk just living their lives the only way they know how. They don't deserve to be punished. I mean, I don't, Odious. Well, that sure sounds like Mr. Thompson. If he was standing here, I imagine he'd remind us of how we're all one big, happy Spacer's Choice family. In Mr. Thompson's eyes, those deserters are still part of the Spacer's Choice family. The family must work together in order to survive. I hate to say it, but I think Mr. Thompson's got a point. Unless those deserters come back, Edgewater's as good as dead. Cutting off their power might be the only way. Miss McDevitt's built something beautiful. Somehow she's talked the ground into giving life again. It's plain to see she's made the veil a better place. Fed the hungry, tended the sick, gave a home to those that had none. But Miss McDevitt delights in Edgewater suffering. She wants Cole. to hurt the town. <laughs> Do you really want to be party to that kind of hatred? Sorry, I didn't mean to babble on like that. I just I felt like I had to say something. Really? I mean, wow. Thanks. I, no one's ever told me those words. In that We're saying area. fuck the corporation. Fuck the corporation. Okay, we need, how do we hack? Where's hacking go to? Is that in tech? 